Rescue me, rescue me, rescue me. Yeah, we are back. And what are we looking at here? We've got Clancy. He's up as our number one dog. Clancy is a great dog. We don't know why he is still here. Can you imagine this dog has been at the shelter since February? Yes. I think it's because he's one of those little brown dogs, if you will, that just get overlooked. But he is a doll, and he's so smart. You can teach this dog to do anything. I think he'd make a great jogging partner myself. He is very house trained, and he would love to go jogging with you. Loves to spend time on laps and is very affectionate. Clancy is our volunteer's pick of May. What does that mean to you? You get half his adoption fee paid for you before you even walk out of the shelter. So he is a deal, but he'd be great at full price. His ID number is 190714, and that's Clancy, and he's looking straight at you out there. Come on down and get me. 190714, Clancy. Have you heard that song, A Dog Named Blue? Well, this is our dog named Blue. She is a doll. Blue is very easy on the leash, and she would love to just spend some time sitting at your feet. If that's what you want to do, that's what she wants to do. She is a mix of an Australian cattle dog, as you can see. She is ID number 120346, and since Blue is a little older, we call her a senior, she qualifies for the senior rebate. That's right, $35 back into your pocket after you adopt Blue. Such a deal. One, two, zero, three, four, six. Every now and again, we have a dog that doesn't do well at the shelter, and so they go out to foster. Well, Stormy is one of them. She's very lucky to be with Sandy there. Sandy is her foster mom, and Sandy knows an awful lot about Stormy, and she gives Stormy high marks in every department. Great on the leash, loves to walk. She is crate trained. She is house trained. She loves to sleep at your feet in the bed and will snuggle and stay close. It sounds high like marks. she's the perfect dog for she everybody. She is the perfect dog. Sandy will meet with you and introduce Stormy to you. If you would like to meet Stormy, you need to call the shelter 781-4400 and ask about Stormy, number 167754. You'll give them your name and number, they'll contact Sandy and put you two in touch. And then you can meet Stormy. It's great to get a foster dog because you'll know so much about that dog when you adopt her. And I want you to adopt Stormy. ID number 167754. You Jack Russell Terrier fans, you know who you are. Here's a great dog for you. It's Chopper. He is house trained. He loves to sit on your lap, but he can be active too. Likes to go for walks and runs and chase balls. He is ID number 145691. That's Chopper. Well, Liza is just showing you how affectionate she can be. She loves to give kisses. Kissy, kissy. That dog is just going to slurp all over you. And Greer likes to get the kisses. She is a great girl, very loving, as you can see, playful and affectionate. She is Lisa, number 192023. Here's a cutie pie. This is a rat terrier mix, and her name is Dancer. We've got a lot of little dogs this week. We have a lot of little dogs, not all brown ones this time. As you can see, she's a nice tricolor. She is ID number 191676, Dancer. Say hi to Charlie. He's a little bit nervous here at the shelter, but once volunteers get hands-on and they go out on walks and they have a little chat with the dogs, they calm down and become a whole lot better. He looks pretty calm to me. Look at that. He's just laying there having a good time. Yes. Well, Charlie's number, if you're interested, is 192051. Just two years old. 192051. This is Kobe, and the first thing on his card, his report card, is very good dog, all in capital letters, underlined, very good dog. So I'm going to say that Kobe's a very good dog. Volunteers seem to know what they're talking about. Also, he has half his adoption fee paid for this very good dog, so why not come down and try Kobe out? His ID number, 191216, and half the adoption fee has already been paid. 191216. Here's little Oso. He's been w with us since March. I can't imagine that. He is such a nice dog. We're calling him a Chihuini because he's a mix between a Chihuahua and a Dachshund. So he's a wiener dog plus a Chihuahua. All of this little package we call Oso. He's a senior, so we will pay $35 of his adoption fee with a senior rebate. 
So this gives you a lot in this little package of Oso. And being uh, a senior, he's going to be a calm dog. He's not going to take a lot of work like a little puppy would. I agree. Look at him. Just sitting there in Judy's lap. That's really all he wants to do is to be with you. You want to watch TV? He wants to watch TV. You want to just stay put and read? Okay by him. Consider Oso, ID number 132286. Well, these two guys have fallen on some bad luck. Their owner died, and the family had to turn them into the shelter. They are so bonded to each other, as you can see right there, that we would really like them to go out together. As an incentive, we have paid half the adoption fee on each of them if they go out together. Now, half, who are half these guys? on each of them? Half so on each of that, them. That makes them a bargain together. Yes, you get two dogs for the price of one, basically. Now, who are these guys? Well, we have Kazzy. Kazzy is the one that is all brown. No black on him. He's sitting with Amy there. And Cosmo has some black on him. Kazzy's ID number are 925783 and Cosmo 925782. They are both boys. They're both four years old. They get along with each other. They get along with other dogs. And they get along with cats. So if you've got any combinations of animals in your home, you can take these two in also. We would really appreciate it, and so would they. Kazzy and Cosmo. The only thing they don't get along with is staying at the shelter, it seems. So let's get them out of here. I like to call this guy Mr. Curiosity, Randy, because he came out here and he was into everything. Well, he seems to be looking real uh, curious right now about where he's going to wind up. Yeah, he's very energetic. This would be a great play dog. He is ID number 191879, and we're calling him Checkers. Well, have you had enough adorable today? I know I haven't. I think Chico is giving us his adorable look. Oh, he's I as do, cute as can be. He is. Look at him. And he can just settle into your arms as well. He is a young boy. He's only three years old. And his ID number is 192055. This is Chico. You know, I want to mention something, T. Uh, because Chico is so small, he can probably squeeze out through a little crack in, under the door. He needs to have a microchip in him. In case he gets lost, he gets found by the uh, animal shelter or a vet, they're going to scan him. They're going to find a microchip in him. So if you don't have a microchip in your dog, you need to get one. And they're only 10 bucks this month at All Limos. 10 bucks? I can't, rem I can't even believe this. 10 bucks. It's like almost free. It's like, you know, unbelievable pricing. 10 bucks, you get a microchip put in your dog, and that'll take care of him for life. Uh, if you want to find out when to go to Limos to get that done, go to limospets.com. If I remember, I'll put that up on the screen for you. And check out the schedule. Ten bucks there and free rabies for your uh, dog, dogs. Dog, all through the month free, of May. You missed your rabies shot for your dog? Go to Limos. Limospets.com. Check the schedule there. And it's not only for dogs, Randy. Cats, too. Cats get the microchip, microchip. not the rabies, not but the they, rabies. Get the, they get the microchip as well. Dogs and cats, ten bucks can't beat that. Well, I have a picture of Eddie here, and the volunteers have put a halo over his head. What do you think that means? <laughs> what an angel. He's an angel. He's an ideal dog. Volunteers can't say enough about him. And I don't know what you think, Randy, but I think he's handsome as can be. He's a good-looking dog. This is a dog that's going to get you noticed. Sit by your side at a cafe. Oh, boy. This would be a great dog for a jogger, I think. He just looks like he'd be out there running somewhere. This is an all-around good dog. This is a dog that could use a boy, a jogger, anybody. Good family dog. At any rate, his name is Eddie. I know you're dying to know that. And his ID number is 192145. Eddie, here is our super senior dog. His name is Bashok. He is a wonderful dog, very gentle. All the volunteers love this dog. Since he is older, he qualifies for the senior rebate. That gives you $35 back on your adoption fee if you adopt him. It's one way we get him out of here faster. Yeah, by offering that rebate, because we, we have a place in our hearts for all of the seniors, and we want to give you the benefit of that money to you. Basak is ID number 034385, and you'd be very lucky to have him. He'd just enjoy doing anything you want to do. Well, this dog is happy. See his tail wagging? Wag, wag, wag. Guess what? His name is Happy. He is a, an eight-year-old boy, so that makes him a senior. That makes him qualify for the senior rebate. Once again, $35 back to you if you adopt him. He is a Bichon Frise. Everybody loves the Bichon Frise. And can you see yourself with him? 
Nice dog. Happy. ID number 900232. Look at that smile. He's working it. Ginger is such a smart dog. Look at her sitting there. She is very, very confident. She is very intelligent. She knows many commands, and I know that you could teach her anything that you would like to. Volunteers give her high marks in that department. Good on Alicia also. She's just totally alert to everything. She Look is at that. Very confident and very intelligent. You can tell. Bad place for a dog down here at the shelter when they're very smart like Ginger. They don't like to be here at all. Half her adoption fee has been paid, Randy. Oh, we got a lot of, uh, you know, these animals have some uh, of their fee or half of it paid. It's, you know, you're getting a bargain when you come down to the shelter. It's a good incentive to get these animals out of here because we are overcrowded. And you what happens when we get overcrowded down here? Not a happy thing. Anyway, let's concentrate on Ginger. ID number 168415. Perfect dog. You're looking at Manny. Yep, he's another little brown dog. He is just about two years old, and his ID number is a 192014. He is so affectionate, and he loves his lap time. This is what he wants to do, sit in your lap. ID number 192014. Manny. Greer just wants to play ball with this dog. I know he does, and Otis wants to play ball back. I hear tell he can have three balls in his mouth, mouth at once. I that don't know sounds that. disgusting. I don't think so. And I don't know. Is it a storytelling time? I don't know. It is Otis. He's got the biggest heart in the shelter. He wins hands down for who's got the biggest heart, and I might say who's got the biggest head. Yeah, he's what Deborah would call a salami a head. A salami head. He's yes, a whole he sausage. Is. He's a blockhead. We love this dog, and we want you to love this dog, too. So half his adoption fee has been paid which means you only have to come up with half the adoption fee and you get this great big hunk of love. He's another bargain. <laughs> he is a bargain. By the pound. By the pound <laughs> and by the tennis ball. He is ID number 191555. Please consider him. We love him. We know you will too. Well, I don't usually think of Larry as the uh, motherly type, but he's just holding that little baby in his arms. Yes, he is. <laughs> he's trying to comfort Pee-wee because Pee-wee looks a little befuddled as to what's going on here. We want you to zoom in on this dog and get down here and take him out of here. He's just the tiniest thing. It won't cause you a bit of trouble. He walks well on a leash. He's great with, it, with adults, calm older kids. He'd love to have you. He'd love to sit in your lap. His ID number is 192010. We've named this dog Slow Dog. S-L-O-D-O-G. Slow Dog. Yep, that's what he's called. He's a very nice boy. Volunteers say that he appears housebroken and he's friendly with other dogs. ID number 192142. Here's a newcomer to the shelter. We found this dog on the 10th of May in Paso Robles on Riverside Street. She is groomed, so somebody spent some money on this dog. Do you recognize her? She looks her. a little bit uh, afraid here, you know? She's yes. probably uh, used to being in somebody's arms at home, and now she's in the shelter in a kennel. She's not happy. No, but we're, we're going to call her Amy if she stays here a few more days, and she'll be available for adoption on the 16th of May. So if you're interested in adopting her, if she doesn't get reclaimed, come on down and ask for ID number 192297. And her name will be Amy if she stays with us that long. Well, I think this is pretty adorable, too. This is Tito. Tito just so happens to be Judy's foster dog. And Judy gives Tito high marks in all areas. House broken, crate train, sits right on your lap or in the sun, whichever is available. Can you imagine? Gives kisses, great with other dogs, a great loyal companion. Judy can tell you more about Tito if you want to meet him. And if you do, give the shelter a call, 781-4400. Ask for Tito, ID number 179529, and they will connect you with Judy, and the two of you can meet up in a park or something and have a get-together. That's Tito, ID number 179529. Now, Lacey here is a dog who will get you noticed. See how she has those pretty eyes with that eyeliner around? She looks so good and gorgeous. I think she is a really pretty dog. Her ID number is 181477, and we believe she's house trained. 
181477 Pretty Lacey. Are you seeing how handsome this dog is? This is Amigo, and I think he's a stunner. You German Shepherd fans, he might be the one for you. Volunteers love this dog. He is super affectionate, they say. He's a little timid, but once he gets to know you, he's okay. And he's quite playful, though he doesn't look like he's playful right now. He is just about four years old, and his ID number is 192171. Well, we do have a little brown dog here. This is Cookie. We got a lot of little brown dogs, but not as many as we've had. Not as many as we've had. We've got fewer little brown dogs and a lot more maybe tricolors, maybe some white. Still a lot of little brown. dogs. If you're a little dog person, this is the time to come. Seems to be a, a plethora, we say. Plethora of a little, a dogs. little dogs. Mm. Consider Cookie here. He is energetic and friendly. He likes to sit on your lap. And he likes other dogs, so if you've got other dogs at home, he could fit right in. His ID number is 191902. Cookie. Again, a very, very handsome German Shepherd. This is Moki. He is just about two years old, and he is extremely house-trained, underlined extremely in capital letters. So I guess the volunteers know what they're talking about here. His ID number is 192108. Handsome, handsome boy, Moki. This is Sammy, and we say he's a uh, lab mix. He is the popular yellow lab color. Sammy's about six years old, and his ID number is 148495. He seems to be a whole lot of fun. I think he could take off a few pounds, and maybe if you get him, you can take him on longer walks than he's been used to, and he can take those pounds off. ID number 148495, Sammy. Here we have a threesome. We've got Frankie, we've got Fonzie, we've got Freddie. We're being all the Fs here. These are all boys. They're all two years old. You could take all three if you like. That would be great to have them all together. They look pretty good together. We have number for Freddie, 192116, and Fonzie, 192117, and Frankie, 192118. Take one, take them all. Here's Scully, and he just where? Wants where is he? Where is he? Oh, wait a second! <laughs> wait a second! There he is! There he is! I found him. Okay. He is a little guy. He might be. No, no. I know that there's a littler one than him coming out because I saw that one this morning. Oh, look at that mean old collar he's got on. He's yeah, a he's real trying bruiser. To look, he's trying to look like a mean guy, <laughs> but he's not. He's very affectionate. He is completely house trained. Any place you put him in the house, he's trained not to go in the house. <laughs> completely underlined. And he will be okay with other small dogs. If you've got another small dog at home, he'd like to be with that other small dog. Or he could be a, a one and only dog. But we dare you to find a smaller dog. Mm. <laughs> Scully just wants out of here. So, if you're interested, his number is 175858. Scully. Well, Kitty here has a hard luck story. Her owner died, and so, obviously, she needs a home. She is a beautiful dog. She is a great Pyrenees. And her ID number is 192196. Please come and see Kitty, 192196. I know you're thinking that we shrunk Kitty down to produce Annie here. No, we didn't. This is a miniature poodle, and we're calling her Annie. She is just about two years old, and her ID number is 192190. And you better hurry up down here because dogs like this fly out of here. Annie, 192190. Here's a pretty gal. She just had her space surgery. So she looks she wiped out. Spayed. Look at she that. She's wiped <laughs> out. But she's good to go. All of our dogs, all of our cats spayed and neutered. Great for you. Great for the rest of the world because we're not going to have many more animals being reproduced if you follow my drift. Sterling is ID number 192176. Here is a cutie pie. This is Cashew. And he is uh, available, obviously. ID number 191275. He is really, really cute. A sweet guy. He loves to be in the lap, and he loves to walk on the leash. So, wonderful. Cashew, 191275. Well, you know that last Great Pyrenees you saw, Kitty? This is her sister, Sweetie. So you can have two Great Pyrenees if you like. Sweetie's ID number. A pair of number, Pyrenees, okay. A pair of Pyrenees, ID number 192195, Sweetie. 
Well, here's another Jack Russell Terrier, and his name is Jack. Looks like a puppy, but I understand he's an older fellow. Yes, he's a senior, and because he's a senior, we give a senior rebate. So $35 back on your adoption fee if you adopt Jack, which we hope you will. He really needs to get out of here. His ID number is 192227. That's Jack. Well, we all just like the look of this dog. This is Gus, and I think he is very handsome and very confident. Now that he's seen himself on TV, he's all like, whoa, who is that handsome dog? Gus knows how to sit, and he knows how to shake. He's a nice dog, and all the volunteers give him high marks in all departments. He is ID number 181862. Handsome, Gus. Well, here we have a Corgi mix. This is a newcomer to the shelter. We found this dog on the 10th of May in the South County on Orchard and Division Street in Napomo. Are you missing her? She's just had a litter of puppies, that's for sure. We know that. She's about a year old, and her ID number is 192293. And if nobody claims her and you're interested, ask for her at that number, 192293. She'll be available for adoption on the 16th of May. Here's another corgi. This is a male. Found this dog on the 10th of May. Same place, Orchard and Division Street in Napomo in the South County. Are you missing this dog? He's about a year old. If his owners don't come to claim him, he'll be available for adoption on the 15th of May. So if you're interested, ask for number 192291. Well, here's a lovable girl. This is Sierra. Sierra is just about three years old. She is a Mastiff mix. She's gorgeous. ID number 191863, Sierra. Do you know where this scared gal belongs? We found her on the 10th of May in Atascadero on Montecito and Las Lomas. She is about a year old, we think, female. ID number 192278, are you missing her? If not, she'll be available for adoption on the 16th of May, and we'll be calling her Tabitha. Okay, we are starting out the cat portion of the program with Cheyenne. Cheyenne is a lovely cat. She is already spayed. All of our cats and dogs are spayed or neutered before you take them out of here. That's great for you. Cheyenne is a senior, so she's eligible for a senior rebate. That gives you $35 back on your adoption fee if you fall in love with Cheyenne and want to take her out of here, which, of course, I hope you do. Cheyenne's number is 192064. That is Cheyenne. Hello, Jet. Jet's just kind of taking a nap here. What else is there to do in this shelter but take naps? These cats get a lot of rest all day long, but that's not what they want. They want your attention. So why don't you come down here and see some of our cats, including Jet. Jet is a female, just about a year and six months old. Her ID number, 192148. Jet. Up next, we've got Betsy. She's a live wire. She's just about two years old, very pretty girl. Black and white tuxedo, long-haired, ID number 191441, Betsy. Well, is, aren't you a pretty girl? This is Rhubarb. She is about a year and a half old. As you can see, she's long-haired and orange. Very pretty girl, very pretty face. Her ID number is 192126, Rhubarb. Well, here's a gorgeous gray cat. I know you... Fans out there of gray cats are going to love Burger. Yep, that's his name. He is just about two years old, long-haired, gray, and gorgeous. ID number 192140, Burger. Well, you're looking at the volunteer's favorite here. This is Bacon. Yeah, another food name. Bacon is about six years old. He's a tabby on white. He's the friendliest guy you'd ever want to meet. And the volunteers have decided he is the volunteer's pick of the month of May. This means half of his adoption fee is paid for you. Yes, just half adoption fee for you to pay. We pay the rest. He is ID number 191884. That is Bacon. Hello, Zen. I bet this is a very calm cat, and that's why she's got the name of Zen. She's just 10 months old. She is ID number 192251. Zen. Oh, it seems to be nap time for Whitney here. She is a very pretty uh, Siamese. She is spayed, and she's just about eight years old. That makes her eligible for the senior rebate. That is $35 off the adoption fee if you adopt Whitney. Her ID number, 191838, Whitney. 
Here's Gracie coming out to meet and greet. She's a very friendly cat. She likes to play. She loves to sleep in the sun. She loves to be on your lap. She is ID number 191837, and because she's a senior, she gets a $35 rebate on her adoption fee. So why not come down here and fall in love with Gracie and take her out of here? 191837. Well, if you like big tabbies like I do, you're going to love Oscar. He's just about two years old. A beautiful big tabby. ID number 192285. Oscar. Here's Pepper. Pepper is female. She's a long-haired tabby. She's gorgeous. She's ID number 192197. Pepper. Say hi to Feather. She is very playful. She's curious about everything going on in her cage here. She's just about a year and three months old. Her ID number 190530. Feather. Here's Candy. That's the first tortoise shell we have today. In fact, I think she's the only tortoise shell we have today. She is female, just about three years old. She's ID number 192194. Very dainty Candy. 192194. Here's Pi. He's so interestingly marked. He is a Lynx Point Siamese. Pretty, pretty eyes. He's just about a year and seven months old. His ID number 191984. Pi. Here's a newcomer to this, sh this shelter. This is ID number 192257. We found her in the North County in Templeton on Terebinth Lane. Are you recognizing her? We think she's about 12 years old. Have you lost her? ID number 192257. She is female. Well, for you black and white tuxedo fans, we have a female cat. She is a newcomer to the center shelter. ID number 192294. We think she's about four years old. We found her in Grover Beach on Rose Court and Farrell. Are you missing her? 192294. Here's Gray. She was turned in by her owner. She's three years old. She's not adjusting well to the shelter down here because she's been in a home and she needs to get out of here ASAP. So consider Gray. Come on down here and take her out of here. ID number 192288. Gray. Here's pretty Penelope. She is just six months old. She's a dilute torty. She is ID number 192173. Here's little Purry. She's just about three years old. She is ID number 192204 and she is very scared to be here like the rest of our cats. If you have any time on your hands and you like cats, why not come down here and volunteer? Get the cats out of their cages, pet them, talk to them, socialize them. It makes them ever so much more adoptable. You'll love it, they'll love it, and the cat will find a home. But consider Purry for right now, ID number 192204. <laughs> 